On January 30, 2017, U.S. President Donald Trump dismissed Acting Attorney General Sally Yates, appointed by Barack Obama, and demoted and replaced Acting Immigration and Customs Enforcement Director Daniel Ragsdale. The move was labeled the Monday Night Massacre by a number of politicians, political commentators and news reports. While the use of the term was questioned by others, the name alludes to the 1973 Saturday Night Massacre during the Watergate scandal, when Attorney General Elliot Richardson and Deputy Attorney General William Ruckel's house both resigned after refusing to carry out President Richard Nixon's order to dismiss Special Prosecutor Archibald Cox. Dismissal of Sally Yates The firing of Acting Attorney General Sally Yates, a career prosecutor appointed by President Barack Obama, followed her refusal to defend Trump's executive order banning the entry of nationals from seven predominantly Muslim countries because she was not convinced the executive order was lawful. In a White House statement, Yates was said to have betrayed the Department of Justice by refusing to enforce a legal order designed to protect the citizens of the United States and to be very weak on borders and very weak on illegal immigration. Many Trump critics praised Yates for standing up against what they perceived as an unconstitutional executive order, but some legal experts including Alan Dershowitz, Michael Gerhardt and Jonathan Adler questioned Yates's decision. Demotion of Daniel Ragsdale Shortly thereafter, Acting Immigration and Customs Enforcement Director Daniel Ragsdale was demoted and replaced by Thomas Homan with Ragsdale remaining as Deputy Director.